Good morning, everyone. Today is Monday, December 9th at 8.11 a.m. Today is free video watch list day. If you don't know, uh, every Monday I put out a free video watch list on YouTube. And every other day, usually I post a uh, video watch list for the members in MIC. So before we get started, uh, if you are new to trading or don't know anything about MIC, me and Bao put together this free two-hour uh, webinar for non-members. Uh, this is kind of your crash course into MIC and trading. Uh, the members have already seen all the stuff, so you don't have to kind of look at it. But if you want to reserve your seat, do it here. We do limited seating every single week. Uh, so if you don't reserve your spot, you're probably not going to be guaranteed a spot. So let's get started. Um, this SAVA is the one that I'm kind of interested in the most. As you can see, the stock kind of tanked from you know 360 all the way down to a dollar eighty. Um, so in the morning, what I'm looking for is if you could see this previous support should be acting as resistance now. So in the morning, I am looking for kind of a push towards these levels. And what I want on my watch is, is 190, uh, two bucks and 210. And the reason I wrote those levels is because 180 is kind of too close. We're already there now. 190 would kind of be a very small starter. Two bucks would kind of be the ad area. And then this 205 to 210 area would kind of be the area that is kind of the most ideal. So that's kind of just how I'm looking at it. This is considered a low hanging fruit because it tanked all day on Friday. So we're looking for bounce today to short it. PTI is a different one. Um, I'm not really too in love with this, to be honest. Like the daily charts just kind of hanging around. I mean, I kind of just had this up there so that we don't really forget about it, but what I see in the morning is, see how this level rejected one kind of two times and a little bit here, so three times. So what I'm looking for in the morning is a push towards this 380, looking to add around 390s, kind of just look at these levels, and add it a little bit more over four, and the stop is kind of probably around 410. So I'm just kind of drawing my lines and setting my orders, and if it hits, it hits. If it tanks, it tanks. I'm not really too obsessed with this. I just kind of want to, Make sure that if it hits my levels that I'm going to attack it. If not, whatever. ACHV, this is the one that I really love the most. So if you look at the daily chart, you see there's a very big resistance at 250. So when it was running pre-market, I was kind of waiting for that 250 level to come, but it never really did. So, I mean, this is kind of the chart that I love to trade because it pushed already pre-market and then spent the entire time selling off, selling off, selling off. So in a scenario like this, we are looking to join the downtrend on this stock so if it pops it's going to be a pop in an eventual downtrend so in the morning looking for a push towards this kind of VWAP level 135 then 145 then 155 165 basically every dime um this to me this seems like it's not really going to come back and if it does these levels are really ideal so hopefully this pops uh, this was my favorite setup of the day but if it doesn't pop then there's no trade OBSV, very similar to ACHV. Notice how it pushed up pre-market and spent the entire time selling off. Uh, basically looking for a pop towards 620. And why 620? Look at this VWAP area. Basically looking to short this VWAP area. Um, and last but not least is AUPH. This had an offering today, and yet it is very strong after the offering, which means that they're probably going to price it pretty good. To me, this is a no trade. Not even touching it. No, nothing. So... That should be it for the watch list. A couple things to know is tomorrow is the lifetime member only trader clinic webinars. Uh, that's gonna be starting at 7 p.m. market time. And if you don't already know, every Monday I like to do a YouTube recap. So that should be around 10.30 or 11 o'clock on YouTube. So thanks guys, I will see you later and good luck today.